How's it going, everybody? Thank you for Marcy Insight here, and today I am reviewing the 2021 LEGO Ideas promo set, the vintage car. This is set 40448. It has 189 pieces and is a LEGO exclusive with purchases of $85 or more, though I believe it is no longer available. I think it might be sold out because I went to make an order yesterday and they were offering the December promo, the skating rink, not this. So I think this may already be out of stock, uh, but it is an awesome promo and they sold a ton uh, in the beginning of January. So I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't have any left. So this set has two minifigures and we'll take a look at those first. So the first minifigure in the set is our female car driver. I do not know if either of the minifigures are exclusives. I think they might be. However, um, for our female minifigure, we have a leather jacket with just the striped shirt underneath, uh, some purple, light purple pants, and then I really like the face print here with these uh, these light purple sunglasses to match the pants, and uh, a fairly standard hair piece, I believe. Uh, you see that uh, she does have an alternate face, one where she's smiling and without the glasses. So that is a nice touch. And then while you're here, you can also see the back printing on the leather jacket. Nothing too special, uh, but a decent minifigure overall. Uh, really fits that vintage 80s vibe that I think they're going for. And then we also have our male minifigure. Uh, this guy, I believe this is an exclusive uh, print, torso print, and it's a really cool looking torso print at that. I really like what we get here. Uh, the, the back printing here is really cool with the uh, squids on the back, and I like the orange and light slash baby blue sort of uh, torso. Nothing extra special going on with the pants here, just uh, some black legs. And then again, I think a fairly common hairpiece in here as well. And this minifigure does not have an alternate face print. So that is not something this guy just has. The pretty standard uh, glasses and smiley face face. So now taking a look at the car build, this is mostly faithful to the original LEGO Ideas submission. Uh, what it's missing here is the chrome parts at the front and for the uh, mirrors and then also at the back and to me that is a big shame the chrome parts were a gorgeous addition to this set I really really loved them and I wish that we were we got them here uh, but I understand why Lego didn't the biggest loss to me on this is the fact that they went with the light blue windshield as opposed to the clear windshield that we saw in the original submission that is the saddest part to me the clear windshield looked much better but other than that it is a faithful rendition. So overall, I really like this build. I think it's great as an $85 exclusive. Uh, it's a, it's a, you know, a reasonable point to get this with 189 pieces. And I feel like that means a lot of people are going to manage to get their hands on this. It does come with two stickers, a license plate at the front and also one at the back. I don't need to show you that. And other than that, there's not too much to point out here. I like the way they did the seating, uh, the beige leather seats, and also having the windshield upside down like this. It looks a little odd from the top. It's faithful to the original, and I think uh, from the front, it looks pretty good. I really like the usage of some of these uh, round pieces, uh, these, these rounded... Uh, tile bricks, I guess we can call them. I really like the usage of that along the front there, uh, the skate blade as uh, the hood on the, the skate blade on the hood of the engine is a really nice touch as well. And uh, the surfboards, I know what they were going for with the surfboards to try and evoke kind of the curved feel of this era of vehicle, but they do come off rather easily just like that. They're not really uh, clipped in too tight. And so that is my one complaint. Like if I go to pick this set up, uh, it's very it's very easy for me to, like right there, I've already just dislodged it just by doing that. Uh, so that's my one complaint with this set is it's fairly easy to knock off the surfboards. But other than that, uh, not a lot of complaints. This is a simple set, basic set. Uh, but a really nice display piece, especially if you're a car collector. And uh, overall, I say it looks pretty good. So quickly, we'll just take a look at the box and the instructions, and then I'll give you my final thoughts on this. 
So this set comes with one instruction book with the LEGO IDEAS across the top, no QR code in the bottom right corner like the rest of the 2021 sets. Uh, at the back here, there's nothing of note other than just the pieces, no other LEGO IDEAS sets for this wave. It is a promo, so it's literally just you get the book uh, standard. I believe this is the $10 uh, size instruction book. Nothing else to say on this. And then for the box is the same thing. It's in the standard $10 box size as well. Uh, it says the LEGO IDEAS logo on the front. And uh, on the top here, you get a look at both minifigures in the set. And then when you flip around to the back, you get a couple different shots of the car, as well as kind of a, just a real short tidbit on how LEGO IDEAS works. Makes it seem a lot easier than it is to get your idea approved. And that is, that is all there is for the box. So like I said, overall I really like this as an $85 promo. I think that you're getting a pretty good value here and it's a nice addition for anyone who's a car collector and lots of other people are just going to get a fun little easy build along with some of their orders online as well. So I think that's great. Uh, it's a, quite true to the original. I wish that we had got the chrome-like parts. That's the only thing that I'm really sad about here. Uh, but overall, uh, a nice build, an easy build, and a fun build. It's nice to get two minifigures that I bo believe are set exclusives. Um, not much to complain about here, other than the surfboards falling off, and I feel like I've said everything else there is to say about this set. Recently, I think LEGO has really stepped it up with their promo game, and the fact that they chose to do an idea set as a promo I think is awesome, and really exciting for the original creator of this set. So that is great, and I like to see LEGO kind of pushing the boundaries with their promo sets. That is always fun, and something that I hope to see them continue to do. If you guys found this review useful at all, if you liked it, click the like button down below to show your support. And if you are looking for more LEGO 2021 set reviews, uh, subscribe to my channel so you can see them as soon as they come out, because I have a whole bunch more coming. I did a massive LEGO haul a couple weeks ago, so I still got a bunch more reviews to come, and a bunch that are already out, so check that out to see what's already there, and subscribe for more to come. I'll probably also be doing a speed build for this set at some point down the road, so again, subscribe if you're interested in that. With all that said, thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one.